Okay, quick little shout out to the uh, handyman pros, everybody else out there. Somebody out there wants to know about what it costs to deal with these outdoor play sets compared to, you know, like buying the components and then designing it itself because you can buy the components separately and then the lumber's over here and all that kind of stuff. Here's the thing on the pre-cut kits. I'm going to give you a big secret on this because I've built a few of these. I've built some of this stuff from scratch, not that much of it, and then we've done the kits. And, you know, my hourly rate or any money that I walk away from, walk away with, not walk away from, on these type of jobs tends to be, during the busy season, pretty, pretty similar no matter how it goes, right? So... A lot of people are going to get frustrated, though, in wondering what they're dealing with on this type of stuff, like, well, how much money are they spending, right? And you'll see different sh kits for different prices. Some are more deluxe than the others. If you really, if you find one that you like, go for it, okay? If you find something that you, you know, you want to do, you want to be creative, you're better off taking one of the set designs and modifying and adding stuff to it then we are totally going from scratch and that's because a rough rule of thumb is that when you do something that's just from straight up lumber you're, you're roughly 50 percent labor 50 percent materials if Something is is above or below that. Usually shouldn't be above that, but it depends. Some some things are labor intensive, and obviously, it's not 50% material such as painting, uh, framing, lumber framing can run a little under that. Kind of people people argue that uh, fence, uh, chain link fence tends to run heavier on material cost than it does on the labor cost. But with these things, you know, rough rule of thumb is middle of the road is it's about half of whatever the kit cost is what it's going to cost to put it together i mean roughly half of what the kit costs is what it's going to cost to put it together give or take a little bit um, the lower end ones it's going to cost over half because most of the guys are going to have a minimum charge they go with um, for but something like this getting done and in you know, getting something like this done for a little over a hundred bucks is probably about right. Getting one of the swing set, basic swing sets done for 50 bucks, well that's where you're kind of pushing it because it's a two-man job no matter what. It's just too awkward for one person to work that alone. The larger kits for four, four fifty, that's about right. You know, that's about right. That's It's about where you'd be. Some of these uh, middling kits can be a little more or less ornate, kind of depends. Um, but a rough rule of thumb is half of the kit cost is, is where your labor is going to be. If you buy everything separate, you're going to probably be at about whatever money you spent on materials is roughly going to also be spent on getting it installed. Uh, plus or minus a little bit, depending on finishing and painting and things like that.